Keller, host and executive producer of Game Changers, here for Sunday, December 20th, with world-class sports handicapper Joe D'Amico, live from Las Vegas, Nevada. Joe, welcome to the show this morning. Kelly, I'm honored to be here. I'm a big fan of Game Changers, a big fan of yours. You know, I'm not just a world champion handicapper. As a matter of fact, I got more handicapping champions than the Yankees have World Series rings. And if you're counting, that's 27. I'm also known as Las Vegas' biggest daily sports better, and I'm here to make everyone out there money, not just this holiday season, but for years to come. Absolutely. Well, we got the Christmas tree behind us. It is going to be Christmas in our sports bidding accounts. We're here to bust your bookie. We are here to get money from the sites. They are loaded up with cash for us to go after. Let's talk about NFL. Let's talk about the first game we're going to take a look at today. Detroit versus Tennessee. Uh, it's Tennessee playoff bound. Detroit having another mediocre season, but Tennessee's defense just not that good. So Detroit keeps this game close, I think. Uh, we're looking at a big, big line on this game. Detroit plus 11 points. We're putting that out, that out for a seven-unit play on GameChangers.ca. Joe, what's your opinion on that game? Well, great minds think alike, Kelly. I'll be honest with you. I don't think the Titans should be laying double digits to just about any team in the NFL or any team above the Pop Warner level. Detroit, a lot of pride, a veteran quarterback. He can and probably will pick apart the Tennessee secondary. They're very vulnerable. I'll definitely take the points here. Uh, Detroit, you know, I really do. This is a team that with a lot of fighting them. They're Jekyll and Hyde. But there's no hiding the fact that, that their quarterback can beat up and pick apart the Tennessee secondary. I'll take the 11 with the, the with the Detroit. Excellent. Okay, let's talk about the uh, quarterback and uh, Kyler Murray with uh, Arizona against Philly. Philly coming off a big win against New Orleans. Uh, Jalen Hurts first started quarterback taking over for a very overrated Carson Wentz. Uh, Arizona's in the playoff chase uh, in a lousy conference, but looked to be a surprise in the playoff. We are leaning towards taking uh, Philadelphia, though, with a six points. I'd like to see it at seven, but, Joe, you're thinking you're leaning to the other side? Absolutely. You know, I disagree, but I'll tell you, I, I think the Eagles are, are, you know, certain betting angles, Kelly and viewers out there, that I don't totally subscribe to, but I certainly put a little bit of stock in, and there's letdown mode. And I think the Eagles blew their shot, you know, after last week. I think they're going to come back down to earth. They beat the Saints last week. It was a tough game. I took a loss in that game, to be honest with you. And this isn't like revenge for me. It's just a smart play. I think they come back down to earth. I feel that Zona is just more talented on both sides of the ball. I think that they, they had a good game last week against a very game New York Giants team. Under a touchdown, I think it's an early Christmas present. Put that under your tree and get paid. Excellent. Okay, now we have a game, too, that we're going to uh, put out that we uh, just started chatting about a little bit earlier here that we both like this Tampa Bay-Atlanta game. Now, this line has moved from five and a half to six. Atlanta as a dog at home. Tom Brady, man, oh, man, you talk about the twilight of your career. I see that sun is setting. Uh, are, we, uh, are we leaning to taking the dog here? I'll be honest. I don't feel too bad for Tom Brady. I don't think we'll see another quarterback in our generation that's going to win as many Super Bowl rings as he has. And let's face it, when you can dump Bridget Moynihan and pick up Giselle, I'm not going to be saying any prayers for you, buddy. But I will tell you this, he is in the twilight of his career. We've seen him look great at times this year. We've seen him look very, very bad. I think he's in trouble this week. Atlanta, eh, they can put up points on any team in the league. And I think that they're really fighting just for a little bit of pride. you know. Uh, and to be honest with you, I really do think they can put up points on Tampa Bay, who at times their defense has looked stellar and at times have gotten beat like a redheaded stepchild. No disrespect to redheaded stepchildren out there. But I will tell you, I think they're giving uh, the general public is betting this game up. And as we know, Kelly, the general public loses more times than they win. So I would go against the grain here. I would take the points here. Absolutely. Because I, think that, I think Tampa Bay's in trouble this week. Yeah, contrarian theory, when you're betting against the public, you are on the right side. We've seen that for years and years, and uh, that's what we're here to point out. We're here to help you bust your bookie. Now, we have got a ton of plays. Go to GameChangers.ca for up-to-the-minute plays on our ticker, and be sure on a daily basis to call Joe D'Amico's free pick line. Joe, what's your number for your full free free pick winners? Well, Kelly, viewers, each and every day of the week, I have a free pick winner on a pre-recorded message line. You don't deal with salesmen, no callbacks, no BS. I know how much you love my voice. 1-800-563-8854. That's 1-800-JOE-8854. And it will also tell you how to get my highest rate of plays on another pre-recorded on my pay pick hotline, which is 855-563-8854. That's 855-JOE-8854. Guys, over five years on the free pick line, 70 plus percent, even higher on the four plus years I've had the paid pick line. Each and every day you call it, and all you got to do is win.
Absolutely. Your numbers, I'm just, I just—I wrote this down, and I've been a client for a lot of years. 659 wins, 345 losses, two ties on that paid pick line. Yeah. It is worth every dollar. We're here to give you nothing but value. Gamechangers.ca, hey, .ca, helping you bust your bookie. Joe, thanks for joining us. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, any social media like retweet, make sure you're following us because we're here to help you make money. Have a great holiday season. Joe, thanks for joining us. Everybody, we will see you tomorrow.